everyone supported this video, we're going to talk about Vita Goran Churam. But first, what is Vita Goran Churam? Vita Goran Churam is a Churam attributed to Vita Goras and the square of the hypotenuse of the triangle is equal to the sum of the squares of the other two sides. Remember, Pythagorean theorem only apply on a right triangle. So, to find the value of x in this example, notice that we have a right triangle so we can use the Pythagorean theorem. So, the formula to get the value of x is a square plus b square equal to c square where the a and the b are length of the right triangle and c is the length of the hypotenuse so here's the length of the right triangle length 6 and 8 and the hypotenuse is the length of the length we can set up the equation 6 squared plus 8 squared is equal to x squared Simplifying from here, 6 squared is 6 times 6 or 36. And 8 squared is 8 times 8 or 64. So we have 36 plus 64 is equal to x squared. Next, 36 plus 64 is 100. And we have 100 is equal to x squared. Now to get x by itself, since x is squared, we we'll take the square root of both sides of the equation. The square root of an x squared is x. And on the left, since 100 is a perfect square, 10 times 10, the square root of 100 is 10. So 10 is equal to x. Notice that we don't use plus or minus because then represent the length of the hypotenuse of the triangle, which cannot be negative. So the value of x is 10. Another example. Paano naman kung ang given ay ganito? hinahanap natin ay ang c squared which is the hypotenuse of the right triangle at ang given naman para sa dalawang lip nito ay 4 squared and 3 squared ang gagamitin pa din nating formula ay a squared plus b squared equal c squared ang given ay 4 squared plus 3 squared kaya papalitan lang natin ang mga letters para makuha natin ang value ng hypotenuse Kung kaya ang s square ay magiging 3 square at ang b square naman ay magiging 4 square. Para makuha natin ang sagot, kukunin muna natin ang value ng bawat legs. So, the first leg is 3 square which is 3 times 3 and the answer is 9. And the second leg is which is 4 times 4 and the answer is 6. Oh, did you learn anything about the Pythagorean theorem? Good, until next time. Bye.